I warned you, Chuck. I need that lunch money. Hello? This isn't funny. I really do not like this. I put that. Let me out. <laughs> Hi ho there, this is Chuck McNorris, doing your post youth ministries Wednesday night wrap up. How are you doing tonight? I am here to speak to you a little bit about boldness. Did I say that right? No, I did not. Boldness! Thank you. That, that just feels much better. So, as we spoke about tonight, and I hope that you were listening very well. I was. I was sitting in the back. You were sitting on two rows of chairs. I was sitting on the stage. I was enjoying myself there. I had a little iced tea. It was very nice. It was very refreshing. Yes, thank you. Um, so, we learned about boredness. And it's in this context that we remember that there are things in this life that we are just afraid of. And fear yeah, is something to overcome. It's not a good thing at all, but... Fear is about everybody's life. We all fear. We all understand pain. We know what it's like to get hurt, and then we don't like getting hurt. It's natural to have certain fears. The people who don't have certain fears, they tend to have lots of scars that don't actually add up to anything. But what we want is we want courage. We want boldness to overcome fear. And the reason that we want this is you're one step deeper, right here, your deeper thought. Deep Thoughts with Chuck Norris. Chuck McNorris, excuse me. <clears throat> Forgot my own name. Um, can we bleep that out? Can we just take that one right out of the thing? That would be real helpful. Okay, thank you. Anyway, Chuck McNorris here again. Hi, Heidi Ho. So, there are certain things that are going to happen in our lives, and they're not fun. But we believe that God is sovereign. That sovereign means he's in charge of everything. He can control it all. He's a pretty tough cookie. He made the world, spoke it into existence. And because he has a plan for our lives and has a plan for all of this universe, we believe, we hold true that God knows the end from the beginning. And that if he has made it within his plan for us to suffer, or die, or be ashamed, or be made fun of, or be pushed into a locker and called it where like a little peep squeak. Not that I ever was pushed into a locker, I was more pushed under chairs. Anyway, uh, <clears throat> so, if it's in God's plan for us to go through things that are not fun, and we are able to accept that, we ask for boldness to face it, the courage to face the fear. Because the fear is real and the bad things are true. But with the courage of God, with the boldness that we can have by His Holy Spirit to face down our fears, that, that, my friend, that is what we want. Lord God, give us boldness because you are sovereign and everything, good or bad, that comes only comes because you allow it. And if you are going to allow us to go through something hard, Give us the strength to face it straight on. Heidi Ho, have a good night. This is so embarrassing. Not again. Where's that lunch money? You need to bring it. Hello, I'm the This is Chuck. See you